All right, guys. Um, I'm gonna be showing you what is was wrong with my headlights for my 1990 Dodge W250. So first things first, I was checking. Do I have power? I took my multimeter to this pigtail right here. Not wanting to come off. There we go. And I just put my multimeter in there. It's still dirty. I thought I cleaned it, but better. But and I was not getting power to there. So, what I did, so I, I heard this term one time, if you hear hooves, don't think, zebras think horses, so you know, try to think of something more simple than your entire wiring system. What does this need to get power? It needs, well, it needs power, it needs ground, and it needs power, so, sounds repetitive. And where does that power come from? It comes from the battery. But what does it go through? It goes through the switch. So, I came here, you know, messing with the switch, nothing happening. And I have the service, I'm lucky to have the service manual. And I looked right here. We got the headlight, the headlamp switch. We got this headlamp switch mounting nut, the cover, and the knob and stem. So what you have to do is take your dash out. There's six screws up top. One, two, three, four, five screws up the top, sorry. There's one screw right here. And I'm pretty sure there's another screw on this side. Maybe not. And so then, this box, once you get that out, there's um, just some electrical, so some connections right here. I'm pretty sure that's it. And then there's three screws holding this box in that houses, that just kind of covers this, covers the, the nut to hold on the switch. So you take that out, this box off, then you can get that nut off. Then with that knot, nut, you will see underneath here, right there, that is your switch and then there's that button right there that you can push in and pull this out to get it out well first you'd want to take that knob and stem out before you get this box off and so i took that out i looked at it you know it didn't look broken but the part is like pretty cheap it's about 13 dollars. we bought them off rock we bought a new one off rock auto and here, here's just another view. Oops. Guess I lost that page. Oh, it's right here. Um, right there, the headlamp switch. That just gives you a better view of it. It's about four, 13, 14 bucks. Put it in there. Got it all good. And the way this gets ground is from that, just make sure it's also getting ground. You have to make sure that. And if it's the connection between, there's a flat area with the threads in between there, just make sure it's, you know, getting around. And that's what fixed the headlights for this truck. Um, I hope that helps. And yeah, my next video is going to be how to install, a, or installing a CD radio in this truck.